Wanted to show you a really quick and easy joining technique. I'm joining together four granny squares. I'm gonna make um, a pillow, but this could also apply to making a blanket or other projects. I am slip stitching the edges together. So I've already started and what I'm doing is, just like the name, I'm just slip stitching on one side and then I'm taking my hook and I'm going over the top and into that red granny square, so the other side, and just making a slip stitch. Now back over to the blue one, slip stitch over to the red, and slip stitch. Back over to the blue. So you're kind of getting the technique here, just working back and forth. You can even have it laid flat like I do, so it's a little easier to see your stitches. Back over the top. So going, I'm going from the top down and just hooking that working strand of yarn and pulling it straight through into a slip stitch. Just love this look. Lay that flat. Kind of looks like a zigzag there. Let's bring it up so you can see. Oh, so pretty, right? So let's keep going because I want to show you once we get to kind of this four corner join. Let me grab some more yarn here. All right, where did I end up? Okay. Okay, so we've made it to the top. I have just the corners to work into now on that blue and that red square. So I'm just gonna do that slip stitch here. And then I'm gonna come over to that corner of the red and slip stitch there. Now I'm gonna come over. It just really helps if you have this all laid out. Go over the top and just gonna slip stitch right in here to the green reach over, over the top. Let me move my arm. Let's see if I can grab the yarn. Show this on video. Ah, Sorry guys, I'm at an awkward angle. There we go. Slip stitch in right to there, okay? So now we have them attached. I know it looks loose, but you're gonna be doing the same thing going across this way. And then we just keep going. So I'm gonna come back over here to the green make that slip stitch, come over to that first stitch of the yellow, and make that slip stitch. So just keep working back and forth, like we did. And it, again, will be very secure here in the center once you um, start on this side and then come this way. And I all right, so I finished um, slip stitch joining the uh, middle section here. So now we're gonna turn this way. And as you can see, these are not stitched together. So um, we are just going to attach our yarn and start slip stitching just as we were these edges together going all the way over the center and um, to the end there. So I'm just going to join my yarn in. Okay, I'm actually just gonna chain one just to get that secure. And then I'm gonna reach over. You're gonna have a little tail there. And we're going to slip stitch that side in. You wanna weave in these tails later. All right, so let's just get going here. So come back over to the red, slip stitch yellow, slip stitch. Okay, over the top. Look how easy that works. Okay. 
Okay. And I will meet you at the middle. Okay, here we are, we're coming to the middle. So just as we kind of did before, we're just gonna keep going. I know it's gonna get a little tight, so just try and get your fingers um, kind of under those stitches so you can see where you are working into. So let's see here. Now going into that corner stitch again. This is gonna be my last one of the yellow side. I'm gonna go in right here, if I can, to the red, just to finish that off. Come on, get that slip stitch right in there. Okay, now I'm gonna come right over to the green. I'm gonna slip stitch right in that corner, and I'm gonna come over to the um, blue, and I'm gonna slip stitch in that corner. Okay, so now we're good. Now it's very secure right here in the middle, okay? So now let's just keep going. So now we're on the blue and the green. So I'm going over the top right into the green, coming over to that next stitch over here in the blue and just working as usual until we get to the end. And then don't forget it to weave in your ends and you're gonna have all of your squares attached just love this look. Let's lay it down so you can see. Oh my gosh, so nice. That nice flat seam. I love it. 